I'm Meg McNamara. Thanks so much for checking out this WJZ.com update. So upper 30s tonight, that's normal for this time of year. The clouds sticking with us, it looks like, over the next couple of days. A warm front set to move through tomorrow. That's going to bring us some showers. And then a strong cold front will move through on Wednesday, and that could bring us a chance for some thunderstorms, perhaps even a few strong ones. Temperatures right now, we're in the mid-40s. Baltimore, we did top out at 51. Yesterday, we were at 64, so today, much cooler. Those winds pretty quiet at this point. Now, the radar and satellite, all we can see over Maryland at this point would be the lovely cloud covers. You can see lots of white there showing us all the clouds. Two rounds of rain on the way. So let's time this out for you. We'll jump the future cast to tonight at midnight. At that point, just seeing all those lovely clouds. Now, here we are. Tuesday morning, 6 a.m., and that's when we start to see this rain getting close to Maryland. Doesn't show up in central Maryland until the afternoon associated with that warm front. And then next up, the cold front. So here we are early Wednesday morning. The cold front starts to move into Maryland, and then we see the showers. It looks like right around 8 o'clock. And keep in mind, it doesn't look particularly strong here on this model, but there is a chance that we could see some thunderstorms as that front pushes through. Now, if you've been waiting for the sunshine, well, it looks like Thursday. That's when we can finally expect that. This area of green here showing the portions of Maryland under a marginal risk for a few severe storms. Marginal is definitely on the lower end of this threat, so marginal being a one out of five, five being the highest, and one being the lowest, but just something that we want to be aware of. We'll have more on that as we get closer to it, of course. Tonight, eventually bottoming out 39 degrees, which is the normal low for this time of year. And then tomorrow we'll be back up to 57, normal high for this time of year, 60. So not quite there, but definitely headed in the right direction with that rain moving in midday is what it looks like for us into the afternoon. So here we are by Wednesday back up into the upper 60s, but thanks to the cold front that moves through on Wednesday, mid 50s there by Thursday, low 60s by Friday with another round of rain associated with another cold front, and that means actually 40s there by Saturday with overnight temperatures, yes, in the upper 20s. So the roller coaster temperatures continue. I'm Meg McNamara with an update coming up on WJZ.